it goes block. So off we go. Oh, Ooh, a late tackle there from Desai. He's going to be in trouble for that. A yellow card. Shot by Dermot Gallagher. And might a bit more serious than Bottle take the free kick himself. It's a good one too. Lamar holding on. <laughs> a man of so many. Teasing Desai. He's already been cautioned, remember. This time, team. That's let in Stoichkov. Stoichkov with the cross. And Pedev can't get on the end of it. He's at Azu. Who, as I was saying, has been referred to Dimenko. It's another yellow card. It's time for Ivanov. Karamber hoisting over the cross. That should be the goalkeepers. Dokiev is just naive, and Lechkov has got away from him. Oh, and Penev has squandered a golden opportunity. His tournament really hasn't taken off so far. This is Stoichkov. Now, is he tumbled then by Desai? Touch of class to their build up play. And this is promising for them. At least it might have been. It's Karambur again. Very prominent at the early phase. Zidane. As he tripped then, it was right on the edge of the box. Kremenliev, who sent him flying. Yellow card there. Now, will it be Djokaev here? Zidane alongside him. Oh. This is Djokaev. Oh, terrific save by Mikhailov. Chipping it round the post. Balakov. All the pass was a bit short then. And Mikhailov certainly had to be underlined with Atletico Madrid last season. Gallagher with a problem. Right. But then they to try again. Lamar. Luckily for him. Yetkov sticking with him. A lot of block has also come up. Ball come up again. So there's plenty of height in there. And they had a flashing into the corner from Laurent Block. Classic header. And France have the lead. Well, they threatened it throughout this first phase of the game. And now they have their reward. Jokiev with a corner. Need to Lechkov. Stoichkov, who was onside. Lamar has just kept the ball in play. Diokhev. Way back, Bulgaria, so many problems. Now, Paul Durkin, the reserve referee, I think is going to have to take over from Dermot Gallagher. Set support. Just really on hand. Desai and Stoichkov. Just losing their tempers. And their particular clash is threatening to boil over. And since then, really, the French have been on Tussler's in midfield, Goran and Deschamps. That goes even off. Deschamps went in foolishly there. I think the whistle are already gone. Even on making the most of it. Even off. Speculative, to put it mildly. I think little... I don't think his coach would have been too impressed. For the number eight there, Laurent Blanc, whose goal divides the two teams. That's it down. Way, way over the bar. He's having a tremendous first half. Dugari could be in here. Oh, clever chip. And Mihailov just got his fingertips to it.
Shades of Shukir with his wonderful goal for Croatia against Denmark with a free kick. Killed over invitingly too, it was Penistars of the 94 run of course. This is Ivanov at the bar. Now can he finish it here? Djokiev beaten out by Mikhailov. <laughs> Half time. The whistle blown by substitute referee Paul Durkin. And the goal from Laurent Blanc. Has... So Bulgaria start the sounds with Real Madrid. Yeah. Offside against Djokiev. Just this time is run. Jacquet, the coach of France. <laughs> Counter attack. That doesn't last long. Jokiev could be in. Mikhailov alert to the danger. What room is available around him? On to Dugani. Up goes the flag for offside. Amazing recovery. You got it. Good at slipping it through. This is Dukayev. And away by Ivanov. Mikhailov was stranded there. Renal Pedros will come on. Fell by Ivanov. It goes block. And it's the second goal. For France and for Laurent Blanc. The Bulgarians simply can't cope with him. And for the second time in the game, a corner kick has produced a goal for the French. Chip through delicately. Kremendiev. Stoich got through the centre. That'll be a free kick. A foul by Lisa Razou on Yakov. In potentially a day. And Penev, no doubt, would like to redeem himself. And for Bulgaria. And he's curled it in. And Bulgaria are right back in this game now. Risto Stoichkov strikes again. His third goal in Euro 96. It's been for some time. I'm surprised they didn't make this change a little earlier. That goal. Penev's team seems to be well out of things. Here's the goal again from Risto Stoichkov. Can they restore the two-goal cushion? Not that way, that's good out. I think by Daniel Podimirov. Cross, oh! Met by Pedros. And that would have been a spectacular. Georgi Donkov from CSKA Sofia. Pedros. Well, the idea was there. Certainly a contender for man of the match. And this time Loco is onside. Away from Mihailov. Loco! And that has clinched it now. Patrice Loco. Showing commendable composure in the penalty box. And for all the efforts of Mihailov to thwart him, those efforts were in vain. And France defeat that cost them their place in the USA 94 finals of the World Cup. Hamburg again, still full of running here, right to the last. And there is the final whistle to signal a French victory, and deservedly so.